The spotted lanternfly invasion is no match for Lucas the Lantern Blaster. How many do you have so far? Ten! Five-year-old Lucas, a huge nature lover, first saw spotted lanternflies near his school and asked his mom why nothing was being done about them if they could hurt crops and other ecosystems. Then, he took matters into his own hands. According to his mom, Lucas has been catching lanternflies for about a month. She estimates that he's caught around 100 of them so far around their New Jersey neighborhood, per NJ.com. Lanternflies are native to Asia, and the first report of them in the U.S. was in Pennsylvania in 2014. This year, they've been reported in several states as far west as Indiana, with the most infestations reported in New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Delaware, New York, and Maryland. The good news? They don't bite humans, so there's no excuse for not getting close enough to squash them, which several states encourage. The bad news? They do love to feed on more than 70 kinds of plants, such as their preferred meal, the Tree of Heaven hops, tree fruits like apples and peaches, pine trees, maple trees, and hydrangeas, among others. Spotted lanternflies suck out the sap from plants and excrete honeydew, which attracts other insects and can cause mold. The mold can, in turn, affect plant growth, harm the ecosystem, and negatively impact agricultural production. Lucas's mom said he got his handy bug vacuum from his aunt, who was going to throw it away until Lucas saw an opportunity. The vacuum is meant for catching and observing all kinds of bugs, and it turns out it's also perfect for trapping lanternflies. Lucas, the self-proclaimed lantern blaster, goes out every morning to catch as many spotted lanternflies as he can, and said he just wants to help and make people happy. The lanternflies currently out and about, like the ones Lucas has been taking down with his vacuum, are adults, and they're getting ready to lay eggs this fall. Any egg masses that aren't destroyed will stick around through the winter, waiting to hatch starting next May.